Welcome to Framework Fortune Crypto and welcome back all you amazing individuals in the Framework Fortune community and all you community members who play Gods Unchained and invest in the P2E game Gods Unchained that is on the Layer 2 Immutable X platform. Well, we just had the Core Set Refresher release and as they said, a new expansion set was coming pretty soon. And I've got two of the cards that have been revealed just today to show you guys directly in the Framework Fortune community. So if you haven't yet, think about subscribing and come join the Discord channel. All you got to do is sign up free with your email at FrameworkFortune.com. But anyway, just got the core set refresher. Now we got expansion set probably coming very soon since we're already getting card reveals. From what I'm hearing, staking is in about two months. That's for the gods token. And this expansion set may be out within the next month. It may be a possibility that we see Divine Order not sold out yet. And they have the new expansion selling at the same time. Now how it all work with weekend rewards and all the P2E, I have no idea yet. This is all new information that I am just getting today and sharing with you guys. But let's go ahead and jump into those reveals. So the first one we got is the Volpine Collector. I think that's how you said Volpine, Volpine, two mana nature card. And oh, I forgot to mention, there's a new mechanic in this new set, which if you've been following the blog, you know, but if you're new, this mechanic did not exist. This card of looks like it has that new mechanic that tempt fate i have no idea what that's going to do i've not heard anything else other than that is the name of the new mechanic so a lot of possibilities the only thing i can really think of that would be similar in the game now to tempt of fate or tempt fate whatever the mechanics called would be like the Averix gamekeeper or Averux Gamekeeper, however you pronounce it, where you can get punished or your opponent can get punished. And I don't know if it's going to be super random or there's going to be some type of technique to it. I have no idea. But looking at this card, two mana, low cost. It is confused, which a lot of nature creatures are, but it is a 3-2 and it is wild, so it'll fit in those wild decks. It looks like it's going to be a common... At its base value now, a 2 mana, 3, 2, nature, wild creature, of course, is decently strong. We'll just have to wait and see what the Tempt of Fate does. Beautiful artwork on it, though. I love how the artwork with each set seems to get better and better. And it's kind of like the uh, little excited fox pup that I've been talking about in the live streams, of how cute that card is in the core set refresher. So we'll see what all comes of this tempt of fate and what other reveals we'll get along the way. You know, it's kind of underwhelming because we just don't know what tempt of fate is. <laughs> but on to the next reveal, we have the Commander Pyros. So if you're a war player, something to get excited about. is a three mana. This is a legendary out of the new expansion set reminder this is not the core set refresher this is a whole nother set like divine order that is going to be out here shortly but three mana three attack three health when a friendly creature survives damage give it plus one plus one that's pretty strong cards like the tamed mammoth could really see a lot of buffing from this card uh other creatures, plenty of other creatures as well. Tame Mammoth is just the first one that popped in my mind looking at it. And besides the Tame Mammoth, any of your higher mana creatures, maybe if you're running Herdicus or Grendel, Prince Hector, the Daemon Prince, you know, where they have big health, they would also benefit from this card. This is just a really strong card in war. I'd say that will probably see play in most war decks. However, you know, maybe these cards change before the expansion set actually releases, so don't get mad at me if that happens. I'm just sharing the information that was revealed earlier today. But that is the two cards, a nice strong war card, and then 
probably going to be a good nature card once we find out what Tempt Fate is. And seeing how good the War Legendary is, Commander Pyros, I would say that the nature one will be pretty strong just by seeing this and more than likely will have some type of interaction with the Tempt Fate mechanic. But that is the two cards so far. Staking is supposed to be out very soon in the next two months. So if you've been holding on to those God's Tokens, waiting for that staking to come so you can get those God's Tokens cash flowing or God's flowing, whatever you want to call it, the time is nearing, which means that governance will probably not be very far off since it is active staking. Many cards I see get revealed. I'll try to get them out as quick as I can so you guys can see them firsthand if you haven't seen the information yet or any updates as well. Let me know your thoughts about these two new cards, the Volpine Collector and the Commander Pyros, down in the comments below. Appreciate everybody joining me as always. Stay safe out there. Until next time. This is war with the enemy. Think that it was meant to be. Living in a time where disease is on every screen. I won't let them fester me. I know most are festering. Negativity is a plague for the mentally weak.